nothing like coming back from vacation to a crazy, crazy busy week of work. <laughs> Yeah, it's been crazy. So last week when we were on vacation uh, down at the beach, I uh, had a lot of fun, it was great. Short trip, but it was fun. We had a good time. Uh, there was nobody covering my physician, <laughs> apparently, while we were gone. Uh, we had made recommendations to do that, but those were not uh, heard. <laughs> so I came home to a crap ton of work, and I'm still playing catch up. It's now Wednesday morning, and I'm still not caught up, so it's just been a busy week. With that said, I had planned to do my Coros Pace review for today, but uh, Coros Pace 2 watch, but that's not gonna happen. So hopefully by Friday, maybe Monday, I will get that watch review out. Uh, I've been using it now for a while. I've done a lot of, uh, quite a few runs with it, some in the trail, some on the road. And uh, yeah, I'll give you my full thoughts and do all and do that. So stay tuned for that for sure, coming out in a couple of days. I've also got this new uh, Bob and Brad C2 mini massage gun to review. Uh, that came uh, while we were on vacation, so I need to test it a little bit. And then I got a, a video coming out on that. I think I've also got another massage gun on the way too. <laughs> so I'm gonna create a playlist for all these massage gun videos. Uh, but yeah, so I've got that and I've got some other videos I need to get done as well. So it's, it's gonna be a busy, a busy time of uh, filming and editing and trying to get caught up on this work. This weekend, we're planning to go. The uh, No Business 100 uh, race that we're doing in October is doing a training run on part of the course. So we're, my, me and my wife are gonna go run that. I'll run that with her. Uh, you know, gotta get used to running her pace with her and helping her along. So we'll practice there, it'll be perfect. And you know, I'll film it. Yeah, should be good. So um, yeah, but my training is going well. You know, I redid last week's training since I was on vacation, didn't get to do much of it. Uh, so, uh, Monday was just an easy 75 minute run with some strides. So I did that. Uh, and then today I redid the hill workout that I did last week, which was a 20 minute warm up. And then I did this on the treadmill, by the way, cause I wanted to be able to control the incline cause it was a hill workout. So I did 20 minute warm up, easy flat. And then I did a six minute interval followed by a five minute, four minute and three minute. Uh, and then after each of those was equal recovery time. So run six minutes hard, six minutes recovery, five minutes hard, five minutes recovery, and so on. Uh, but that was a 10% incline on the treadmill. And I did that uh, average throughout those whole things was probably like a 920 pace because um, it was supposed to be like a 70 to 80% uh, effort uh, at 10% incline. So it was good. It was good. Uh, I did that last week too and the week before that, uh, a little bit different time, but uh, it, was, uh, it was a good workout. For sure so uh, I can feel myself getting uh, my base coming back to me you know so it's it's going well tomorrow I've got another I think like 75 minute maybe 90 minute run tomorrow and then Friday I've got a two-hour run and then Saturday uh, the long run is gonna be probably about five hours it's supposed to be four hours but extra hour won't kill me <laughs> you know so uh, my coach will understand but yeah, so that's what's up. It's just been crazy busy. So sorry I couldn't get the watch review out uh, to you guys today, uh, but it will be coming out soon. So keep an eye out for that for sure. Also just wrapped up uh, an interview. Uh, I was on somebody else's channel. That'll be coming out in a couple of weeks. Uh, so I'll be sure to let you guys know about that uh, so you guys can watch it and go check out the channel. And uh, yeah, it was, a, it was a fun chat. So I'm looking forward to you guys checking that out too. So stay tuned for that and I'll keep you posted when it comes out. I'll let you know which channel and all that. And yeah, so stay tuned. And don't forget to give the video a thumbs up, big like, if you wouldn't mind. It really does help the channel out a lot in the video. And if you're new and you want to click subscribe to see that watch review coming out in the future, maybe the massage gun or other things, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Turn on the bell notification. That'd be really cool. So just a little like YouTube side note, you know, through analytics. I get a lot of people to my channel that are not subscribers. Um, you know, I get my subscriber base comes back, but I get a lot, like probably two to three times more people coming to the channel that are not subscribed. So, hey, if you see something you like, click that subscribe button. That'd be cool. <laughs> but yeah, that's gonna do it. So just kind of a little update today. It's been crazy busy. So uh, yeah, hopefully, hopefully I get caught up soon on work. Uh, but anyway, if you wanna take a look at the video I put together on why I went plant-based as a plant-based athlete and what I eat uh, in training and racing, take a look at it. It's gonna be over here on this side of your screen. You can take a look at that. And then over on this side will be a playlist of trail running videos to take a look at. So check out one of those. Thank you for watching. I appreciate you all, and I'll see you on the next one.